Welcome to your new Integrated Forms workflow. To begin, you'll use the top navigation ribbon to move to Forms. You'll see this takes you to the Integrated Forms page. By default, you'll be on the Forms Request section. This gives you an eye on every request that's been sent out through your account, whether those requests are being sent automatically using templates or they were manually sent using the new form request option. Here, you'll be able to see every form that's been sent to a patient, the due date for that form, the status of the request, as well as a copy of the forms that were sent to them. That status is going to update every step in the process, from the patient not clicking it, viewing an individual form, all the way through completing the forms and syncing it into your EHR. You'll notice some forms will have an eye icon next to it. That indicates that the patient has read and started to complete their form. Some forms will have a check mark. That indicates that the patient has completed the form. Once the patient has completed the form, it will automatically sync back into your EHR and be available for you in the Document Center. Should a sync fail, you always have the option to manually sync it using this blue sync button. In addition, from this page, you also have the option to send an ad hoc forms request. Here, you'll just enter the patient's name, select the due date for your forms, choose the form you'd like sent to them, and click send. If you navigate to the forms and packets page, you'll see here you get view access of all of the forms that are available in your account for patients to complete. Admins will also have access to this customized forms option. This will take you directly into EndLive, where you can manually edit any forms. As far as sending forms automatically, you now have more power than ever located in templates. You'll see in any of your templates, when you go to edit the email, there are now smart commands called forms. Just select where you'd like that button to go, and then choose the appropriate form button. You'll see this creates an option for patients to fill out their forms, sending automatically using the same templates you're already familiar with. When a patient completes their form, you'll get a notification here in the dashboard under Forms, as well as in the Integrated Forms tab. Now you're ready to go with your new Integrated Forms workflow. We hope you enjoy.